Hello, my name is Philip, and I'm a developer here at Ashley Audio. In this video, we're going to cover saving your design. Currently in the Ashley Remote app, I am in edit mode, and I can move the controls around um, on my page, and I can change the properties of the controls, and um, when I'm done making any changes, it's automatically going to be saved, but that save is happening um, into a working settings file. Um, so one of the things is with a working settings file, uh, if I load up another design, anything that was in working settings gets overwritten. So I could potentially lose all of my work. So I want to save it out explicitly as, um, as my own design. Uh, also, if I save it out explicitly, that'll allow me to export the design as well. So let's go over how to do that. Um, we need to find the miscellaneous button. We need to find file options. On this file list menu, we can see all of the designs that have been saved out um, for our Ashley Remote app. And so what we want to do is we want to add our design to this list. So to do that, we're going to need uh, to find this save button. And then we'll see a save file menu. This allows us to um, enter a file name that we're going to save our design as. Um, and when we click or when we touch this uh, input box, we'll get some native controls that allow us to enter the text for that. And uh, when you're done entering the text, um, you just hit return on the keyboard and the, the name should appear in this list or in this box here. Um, once that name appears here, you're going to hit save file and then it'll be added to the list. And that's how we know um, that our design has been saved. And then now that it's in here, it'll be available for exporting in iTunes. And also you can load it up later. And that covers um, saving a design. So thanks for watching. Bye.